bloody hell. Oh, I think I fractured something. Oh, me bloody hit. Why is there little people in my house? Excuse me, Miss and Miss, Mister, Mister, I can't, Mister and Mrs. Bigfoot, get out. This is my house. I had a really big party last night. And I don't remember a single thing. I don't know if I invited you over to stay or not. Ooh. Much better. I don't know if I invited you to stay or not, but please. You need at least one point hobbits alignment. I am aligned with you people. I helped you for so many. A fine meal is always the best. I cooked last night, you fool. Do you know how much I cooked? I cooked so much food. So many people. And none of them even care. Ah, screw it. I hate the hobbits. I'm leaving. Alrighty then. So we're here and we want to make it all the way up. Where are we going? We're not going towards that way. We need to go to that. Oh, really? All the... Ah, alright. Let's fast travel and let's get on our way. Bye-bye, buddy. Have fun with your horses and junk and everything else that you've wasted your time on. We're off to see a wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. Because, 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 because... because Sauron called me. 100% Sauron called me. I'm used to being out in me old home. Me old burrow in the ground. I'm used to, I'm used to seeing dirt and cobblestone walls. I'm not used to seeing this type of land. Big old stone. You know, we probably should get started with stone tools or something. I just realised we have absolutely no tools but sulphur matches and a bed. Last time I was in this, didn't I get attacked by a bunch of trees? I'm pretty sure I got attacked by a moving horde of trees somewhere around this area. Don't know where it was, but it was somewhere. You're wondering why the render distance is low, ladies and gentlemen? There is a very good reason for that. And that is it'll lag out, and we don't want that map. Ah, just like that. Gandalf, me old friend. How's it going? Oh, yes, please, I'll take the book. Thank you. That's nice. Open. But sure thing, mate. Ah, yeah. You'll burn to death. Oh, it's a ranger tower! This stuff's awesome. Yes. Hello. Welcome. Good evening. Hello. Oh, this is good as. Uh oh. Uh, I need to get up here, but I seem to be having the most trouble getting up here. I'm up. Now, last level, and I believe. Yes. And I got. I did all that for a plum. Time well spent. One alignment with the Dunedain. Yeah, uh, seems like a lot of work. Bye bye now. I was gonna light their tower on fire, but then I realised that'd probably get me in trouble. Not just with the Dunedain, no, with a lot of other people, because people are picky. I was thinking of aligning, because if you align with a faction, apparently you can get a huge army, which is what I was thinking of aligning with, like a bunch of Dunedain for. If I align with the Dunedain, they'll think, you know, whoa, cool. We can get an army and we can, like, raise it in... Oh, hello, what's this? Hold on a minute, what's this? Oh, it's a Dunedain camp! Are you a friend or foe, Bluebird? Oh, I'm a friend. I'm a very big fan. I like your faction because when you align with you, you just use are like archers and stealth archers, but when you get found, you just charge in. He's a cool as a compass. That'll help. A compass will help. I'm just gonna take your table, don't mind me. I didn't steal anything yet. Yeah. It is quite wrong to steal their stuff straight away as we meet them. So if we meet another, like say two camps, then we'll start stealing, cause then it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter cause they know we're friendly. And they think, hey, you know, this guy's pretty cool. We'll let him have a tent and all the stuff in the chest that we own. Cause we don't have homes and Oh boy, I sound like a really bad person, don't I? This is the longest road I've ever been on with nothing on it. The best I've seen is that one camp and all the Dunedain. This is painful. I've I've seen people make videos on this where they walk the whole map. Like walk, not run, they walk. Do you know how much pain that would be? 
the amount of pain those people must go through is astronomical. I've got no, those are the biggest words I've ever used and probably ever will use. They, that, the pain that they suffer doing that type of stuff. Oh, we haven't got an offhand in this one. Damn, alright. This is such an old Minecraft version. I think something fun would be out here, like a slide or a big old treadmill way that takes you across the map in two seconds, but guess what? Nothing but good old pa- Ooh, hello, hold on. What are you? What is this? What are you? Hold on. We could have just found our base. Almost at the top. Come to find out your secrets. Oh, we're short. What's this? Oh! Yes! Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, that's good as. I'm gonna take the chest too, that's even better. Now how do I get down? That's fine, a little bit of fall damage never hurt anybody. Ah, that's fine, that'll buff out. That's good as! Well now we've got a weapon. Hold up, how does it look in our hand? Oh yeah, with the Gondorian... Gondorian? Arnorian leggings. That is amazing. By the way, ladies and gentlemen, in this series, I have aimed to accomplish the achievement of being a king of a faction. Whether it's Sauron's factions, or Gondor, or Rohan, or anything. I will either be a lord, like Sauron in the Orcs, or I will be a god among men. Or I could be Elven, or Dwarvish, even Dwarves. That's what I was thinking of originally, dwarves. They, they're they good. There's thousands of them. Whoops. There's thousands of them. They have, they mine. They have thousands and millions of gems and stuff. They live in the side of mountains. Who's going to raid us? Huge orc party come and try and raid inside the mountain. They're going to have to get through the front gate, which is the huge mountain wall. How are they going to know where we are? How are they going to know where we live? What are they going to do? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Because they can't do anything. I believe it's on a different, um, on a different world, but I've built a huge fortress for dwarves, and I've made a huge mining area with a few other mods, and I, um, t I tell you right now, it is amazing. I've, my mining facility is the best. We've reached a new era. We found another camp! We can take one of their tents now. We are a part of your culture. We have your leggings. That makes us technically a part of your culture. Now give me the leggings. And give me the rest of the armor. And the tent, please. Pretty please with the cherry on top, I wasn't demanding. If I was demanding from you lot, that would be terrible. Terrible, absolutely devastating. That's why I'd never do that. You lot know that, you know that, Captain. Chieftain. Sir. You know exactly what I mean. Oh no way, this is a big ranger camp. And that's inside, this one's inside the mountain. This is what I mean by the dwarven things. Our front gate would be here if it was on a miniature size. We'd be the size of that grain. There'd be a huge army of grains. And then that's our front gate you have to get through. That would be amazing on that scale. We'd be invincible too. Oh, a scroll, finally. Those are really good, especially when we're upgrading. What is this, and why do I want to go into it? Oh, it's another tower. Oh. I want to go. I want to go. I need to go. You know, I need to go. I need to go up it. There's no hope. If I don't go up it, we're screwed. We're missing out on so much. And the annoying thing is, I know it too. If I don't go up it, I know what I'm missing out on, which could be a chest full of goodies. Yes. Oh. Silver ingots will be amazing when we finally hold up to figure out what does the most damage. 5.5, 6.5, 6.5. Well, 
when we finally actually get the uh, armies and stuff going and the castle fortress, that stuff would be amazing. That stuff, absolutely infinitizing amazing. I have no words that can even describe the amount of goods that will come out of that castle. I just need to figure out what faction. I was originally thinking the Dwarves or the Dunedain. But the Dunedain only have one type of soldier. They have people on horses and stuff, but they mainly use bows when they're at long distance and when the Orcs actually get to them, they use short distance. And they're all the same units. Dwarves, on the other hand, they have, I believe it's if they have miners, collectors and stuff, or whatever the other things are, crossbowmen, spearmen, warthog riders, they have a huge range. And then orcs, orcs and stuff, yeah, it's orcs. They have thousands upon millions of different things. Spider riders, I think, are in Mirkwood and stuff. They have orc chieftains that ride huge things they have elephant riders I don't I believe I don't think that's the orcs I think it's something else related to the orcs anyway ladies and gentlemen thank you for watching the first episode I think this is where I'm going to call it quits and I'm going to put down me bed go to bed go to sleep wake up the next morning feeling a lot more better goodbye